All right. Hello, everyone. Hope you're having a good week. Hope everyone's doing well. Got Christmas coming up soon. And I wish you all a very Merry Christmas. Hope you have a really good time. Have fun with your families. And sit back, relax, and just enjoy the holiday. Um, I wanted to do this quick video about my new favorite Klee uh, music player. I found it by accident. Um, it's called Mock, M-O-C, and that stands for Music on Console. Now, I know there are other console-based uh, music players, but for some reason, I just really enjoy this one. It's a little bit simpler, I guess you could say, to use than maybe Seamus. And I don't know, it's just, it's just, I enjoy using it. I don't know if that's something you might be interested in, but if it is, maybe you have a low-powered machine and you don't have much RAM. Uh, this might be something you might find uh, worthy to try out. I think it's worthy. But <laughs> the, the rest is up to you. So let's just go ahead and show it to you. Now, what it is, it's in, this is my minimal dev one build right here. And it's also in OpenBSD, baby. Yeah. <laughs> so just a apt install MOC mock, or if you're on... OpenBSD package add mock. All right, let's go ahead and look at it. Now, before we do, let me clear because I want you to see what it looks like when you first open it. Let's see, show hidden files. Go to mock, and I'm going to clear this right here. Last directory. Okay. Now to run it for the first time, just open up your terminal and type in M-O-C-P. Okay. Ooh, and there's what it looks like <laughs> the first time. Uh, let me increase the font size so you can see it better. Look at that. I still remembered how to do it. Um, so what you'll do, you'll come down here to wherever your uh, music is, click on it. I'm using my arrow keys. Click on it, blah, blah, blah. Okay. So let me close this out. All right, so that's basically what it is. Now, what I've done, I have made a desktop file for it because that's the way I roll, baby. <laughs> and that's the theme I'm using. Let me close that out because I have also made a keybind for it. Let me hit my keybind. There we go. Let me close that out because I've also made a hot corner for it. <laughs> okay. Now, let's go up back up to the directory. And I don't think I don't think Ghosty will mind if I play some of his just a little sampling of his music. Now you can hit the L and that will do away with that double pane right there and you can you can see in there let me find my favorite song from ghosty there it is all right now to pause it you can hit the p your p key or if you're if you're just really really tired and you can't reach all the way up to your P, you can just hit the space bar. 
and that'll do the same thing. <laughs> but now let's look at if you hit H for help, that will show you some of these keybinds, okay? And there's several in here you can go through. Hit H again to get out of that. T, capital T, I believe it is. Capital T. Here's your different themes that come out of the box with it. We'll look at black theme. And that's what it looks like. Let's do T again. Dark dot theme. Now a lot of this, how it looks, is going to be dependent upon what terminal you're using. Okay. Uh, example theme. That's not the one you want. That's the one that showed up when I first started it up. Green theme. That's the one I'm using. Mocha theme. Let's try that one. There's that. Nightly theme. That's not too bad, but let's go and try the red theme. And that's red. <laughs> Transparent background. <laughs> that's not uh, that's not too bad. And let's try the yellow red theme. That's not too bad. But I'm using the green theme is the one I'm using. All right. Now, let's see. Is there really anything else? There's nothing really much else to go over with. I mean, the keybinds are pretty straightforward. If you want to adjust the volume, let me go ahead and start playing this again. You can adjust your volume down with the comma or up with the period. And that's pretty much it. Now one thing you do want to to close this out is capital Q. Let me show what happens if you don't hit capital Q because I haven't figured out how to get it back yet. <laughs> Alright, I'm just going to hit Q. Oh dear, look at that. It disappeared and <laughs> I don't know how to bring it back yet. <laughs> so, what we're going to have to do is let me open up my run command, kill all, M-O-C-P. There we go. <laughs> so just make sure, just make sure that you hit capital Q to get out of it. All right. Now there is a website for it, and on that website, uh, there's a contribution in the forum on the website. If you go to the forum, look at contributions, I think that's the part that it's called. There's people who've made other themes, uh, made some plugins for it, and so forth. I might try to make my own theme for it, I don't know. Themes are pretty straightforward. Out of the box, the themes are found in, let's see, user, share, MOC themes and let's just I'll open up this green theme that I'm using and I mean that's that's the whole theme right there now the example theme that's the one that'll give you some more instructions you can come through here and read about it if you ever want to try to make your own uh, theme. But that's it. Ghosty, I hope if you watch this, I hope you didn't mind me letting people sample your music there. And I guess with that, I will say have a good day. And you guys take care. Um, I did mean to mention this. Uh, when I, I did check the RAM usage, uh, it, it was running, I guess, about 
I'm going to say 20 megabytes of RAM above, you know, what it was, what my system was doing before I started mock up. So it's lightweight, easy to use, nice clay based, uh, clay based music player. So there you go. You guys have a great day and take care. Thanks.